I am currently outside of the US and I'm able to use Cash App as you can see right here on my PC. So I'm going to show you how you can do that as well and the only VPN that actually works for this. So let's say you are a US citizen but you're out of the country and you need to use Cash App but can't get it to work. So here's how you do it. So for this we will need two things. We will need a VPN like I said and the only one that worked for me is NordVPN. You can get it from the link below. It is going to be also in a pinned comment and I will earn a small commission. It is an affiliate link if you get it. But NordVPN is the only VPN that actually works for this. I've tried multiple other VPNs and I haven't had luck with them. But NordVPN, I can confirm, works. So get it with the link and then here's what you have to do. You will be taken to this page right here. You can get NordVPN. You can select a two-year plan, a one-year plan, a monthly plan if you would like just to try it and if you're out of the country for a month you can just try it for a month and also there is there is a 30 day back money back guarantee so if you want to just try it or if you need it for one month you can get this option right here so you can just get the cheapest option for a month which should be like 15 dollars and you can just get standard so if you require NordVPN for or if you want to use Cash App for a longer period of time you can get of course one of the other options for a subscription so as you can see right here you will have to write in your email uh, your email address and there are very there's a variety of different payment mob options you can either use credit card debit card Google Pay PayPal or even cryptocurrencies so it will tell you the whole amount right here that you have to pay and then it will uh, very easily create an account for you. Okay, so after you have bought a subscription and you have logged in with your account, then what we have to do is go to downloads and here you will see the VPN solution or VPN for uh, Windows 7, 8, 10 and 11 and we just want to download the app so it's going to look like this and basically right here we just want to click on the setup icon click on yes and it will guide us through the installation process so just click on next a bunch of times and you will have nordvpn set up so that was the first thing that we needed to do now the second thing that we actually need i'm not going to do it because i already have nordvpn installed so the second thing that we actually need is this this emulator code bluestacks 10 so just click on bluestacks 10 and then right here you will see the setup for it so select it and it will take a little bit of time to install because it is a rather uh, heavy uh, emulator but it will work in the end so as you can see right here I have the option to update you will have the option to actually install it so you just click on install and it will automatically install it for you you just have to press next again a bunch of times and it will uh, actually walk you through the process through the installation process and in the end you will have NordVPN and the emulator so I'm just going to come back in a second because like I said, it might take a little bit of time. So just bear with me. Okay, so now we have NordVPN installed and Bluestacks 10 installed as well. So what is the next step? Well, first we have to open up NordVPN right here and it will probably ask you to log in with your account if this is your first time opening up the app. But I'm going to show you how it works. So it's going to load up right here, NordVPN, it's going to detect the country you are currently in. And basically, I'm just going to restart this, just give it some time, sorry for this. So here, uh, this is what the main page of NordVPN looks like. And basically, if you want to connect to a US server, all you got to do is press on the US flag right here, and it will uh, automatically connect you to the best server, and it's going to give you a 
a notification right here like you just saw so now we are connected to the united states server now what do we have to do we can just close out of this it will be minimized right here as you can see and it will say that it's connected so the next step is just opening up blue stacks uh, like i said it might take a little bit of time for this to load up for the first time but it is blue stacks 10 so that is the uh, newest version. So right here, just uh, get rid of these notifications right here. And okay, so this is what we do. So you wanna search right here for Cash App. And as you can see, now it pops up. It will give us the option to play it. So you wanna click on play on app player. Okay, so it just loaded for me completely, but it might require you to download it from the Google Play Store. So basically you just have to log in with any account that you have on the Google Play Store or any Google account actually. And then you can just download it there and the installation process is fairly simple. But for me, as you can see, it logged me in directly. So I'm just going to log out and show you what it's going to look like. So I'm going to sign out and then we are going to click on add a profile to this device so this is what it's going to look like you will have to write your phone number however if you're creating a new account you can just use an email and here you will write your email address so i can write uh, whatever i want so for example i'm going to use a throwaway email that i have Okay, and then we have to confirm the email address. So I'm just going to come back in a second. Okay, and once you have created your account, you don't have to link anything. Uh, we can just enter it right here. So just give me a second. Okay, so once you have confirmed your email right here, you can just skip the debit card option altogether. You can invite people or you can just close out of this and it will give you the thing that uh, you are now officially in Cash App. So you can do anything you need to do with Cash App with this version. You can link banks, you can link a debit card, you can invite people, change your personal info, receive money, so on and so forth. So it's really, you can just use all of Cash App's features that way. So hope this was helpful, informative, don't forget to like and sub and I'll see you guys next time.